I can read. Choose the storyteller you would like to. Vyasa's Mahabharata, retold by Chit. Long, long ago, when mountains were hills, forests mere saplings, oceans little ponds, and rivers only streams, long, long ago, when gods roamed the earth, there lived a wise old man called Vyasa, son of the great sage Parasara. <laughs> Vyasa was a philosopher who loved stories. He also loved to talk. He talked so fast and so much that people were always telling him to slow down. But on and on and on he went until he himself cried, Stop! <laughs> Philosopher means a person who seeks reason and truth by thinking and meditation. Vyasa had just completed the massive job of putting together some really ancient writings called the Vedas and his fingers were sore from gripping the quill. But did he take a vacation after this? Oh no! He did not take a month off. He did not take a week off. In fact, he did not take a day off. His head, oh his poor head, was now bursting with new ideas. In fact, a whole new long, very long story. This new long, very long story called an epic was about the descendants of a king called Bharata and their great and not so great deeds. Not only did these tales fill his head, they were popping out of his ears, his eyes and even his nostrils. So swiftly did the tales come that Vyasa felt he needed more heads. more eyes and more years to be able to cope with the characters and the twists and turns of their stories. To top it all, Vyasa kept hearing a word. Tap on. Which language would you like to hear the story in? Tap on Vyas ki Mahabharat Punar Kathan Chitra Krishna Chitra Arun Kumar Or Anuad Sushma बहुत बहुत समय पहले जब पहाड़ पहाड़ियां थे जंगल सिर्फ बेलबूट समुद्र सिर्फ छोटे तालाब और नदियां सिर्फ चश्मे बहुत बहुत समय पहले जब देवता पृथ्वी पे घूमा करते थे वहीं एक बुद्धिशाली बुजुर्ग भी रहा करते थे उनका नाम था व्यास महान ऋषि पराशर के बेटे व्यास एक दार्शनिक थे जिन्हें कहानियों का बड़ा चाव था उन्हें बातें करना भी बहुत अच्छा लगता था वो इतना ज्यादा और इतना तेज बोलते थे कि लोग उन्हें टोकते ही रहते धीरे बोलो धीरे बोलो धीरे बोलो पर वो तो बोलते जाते बोलते ही जाते और हार कर अपने आप ही चिल्ला पड़ते रुक जाओ
व्यास ने अभी अभी वेद नाम के कुछ बहुत ही प्राचीन लेखों को जोड़ जाड़ कर लिखने का बहुत बड़ा काम किया था Tap on Read and Learn to read along with the story in English. Fun do da do. Here's something fun for you to do. Answer these questions and find out how much you know about the Mahabharat. What was the name of Dronacharya's son? Option one, Ashwatthama. Option two, Karna. ऑप्शन थ्री अभिमान्यु वेल डन टैप ऑन 